How did your 1984 talent exchange with Bill Watts come about? Hey, oh boy. <laughs> Bill called me and said, uh, I'm really in trouble. Can you come? Can I come up to see you? And over the years, Bill and I had had conversations about our relationship with God and so Bill knew that I was a very spiritual person and he said uh, can I come see you so I said sure so Bill came up and started the meeting by walking over to my desk and getting down on his knee and reaching to hold my hand, which is a, you know, I don't know if you're religious or spiritual, but that's a humbling yourself in that way is a, is generally a very revealing of what's in your soul. So uh, he said a prayer, and uh, then he got up and he said. Uh, I've really screwed up. My talent is lethargic and old and, and I can't get a lot of people to come in because I've been a horse's ass and I really need your help. And he said, I know that you're selling out every night of the week and have been for a year or longer. And I said, yeah, yep, we're really blessed. And I said, uh, Bill, my talent in, is totally, totally different from your talent. Uh, we have a, you know, we our wrestling is almost a fast forward compared to yours. And uh, he said, I, I'm, I'm willing to learn. I'm willing to change. So I said, um, all right, let me see what I can do. So. I, I had at that time, it's funny how things work out, I had so much great talent that I was having to run three towns a night to make it work, you know, to keep them all busy. Right. And that was taxing on all of us, you know, we were we were just too big for our britches. You were running seven nights a week too, weren't you? Seven some days place. a week, two and three matches a day. And uh, so I, I said, okay, this will, this crew will help you. So I sent him the Rock and Roll Express, the Midnight Express, Terry Taylor. I can't remember who else. And Dundee, I, I said, you'll need a booker because you don't know how to promote this town. So I was, had none to damn. So then I got on the phone and called them all and said, uh, it's not that I'm choosing anybody over you, but I want to help Bill survive and you guys can do it and in the process you'll make a lot of money. So everybody, strange as it sounds, everybody said whatever's best, can I come back here when I run's over? Sure. And they popped his territory. I mean really popped it. Has it perhaps his best run. And maybe that wasn't good for him because he then thought he could compete nationally. 